Tasty Jugglers, Dexter Thompson and his Chocolate Harmonica, the musical stylings of Bicentennial Crab, and featuring six of the eight original Plimpaloon and Giant Floating Baby Head A long time ago, not too long though, deep in a forest, away from the sea, there lived a small, little wee bear called Baby Bear. He lives with his mother, which always wear a ribbon on her right ear, called Mama Bear. And not to forget, also his father, which always wear a red tie. Even at home, called Papa Bear. They live happily in a small yet cozy cottage which is far, far, far away from people as they don't really like them. This is all because they think that they are different from those kind of people. Whereas people live in a place called the city where there are lights, actions, and everything else. There's also an exceptionally young and adventurous girl who lives there. Her name is Goldilocks. She lives with her beloved, caring, and of course, amazing parents for 12 years now and counting, with her pet cat Tom and her pet, dad, pet dog Jack. They live in a very normal house right in the middle of the city. One day, as Goldilocks was bored playing with Tom and Jack, she decided to take a walk. While she was walking and walking and walking, she found a really weird and narrow road. Curiosity Talks takes her she straight away took the course without any hesitation, with a smile on her face. After she walked for a while, she found a very mystifying forest ahead of her. Wow! she exclaimed. Hurriedly, she explored the forest and found a nice little cottage. She opened the door and went inside. Wow! she thought. As there are one, two, three bowls of soup on the table. Suddenly feeling very hungry, she went and slurped all the soup thoroughly. Oh dear, supposedly she was to feel guilty for eating others' food. However, Goldilocks thought, Oh dear. I'm sleepy now. Looking around sleepily, Goldilocks saw another door. She went and turned the knob, straight away went inside. Goodness gracious, she said as she found a very comfy bed. She pulled the blanket and let herself in. In a few seconds, she has already fallen into slumber.